The Majestic. The Majestic. The Great War of 1914 to 1918 saw bloodshed, heartache and devastation around the world. However, among the tragedy is the tale of the Christmas truce. This iconic moment of history tells the tale of soldiers on opposite sides coming together in a moment of peace during Christmas Day 1914. Number 1. Contrary to popular belief, first-hand sources reported that the Christmas truce was not a large-scale event. Few soldiers participated in this unofficial ceasefire, although the Pope at the time had tried to push for a truce of God for the Christmas season. Since this was rejected, hundreds of soldiers went on fighting during the month of December, including Christmas Day. Number 2, Silent Night is the carol which is most famously connected to the Christmas truce. The German soldiers sang this first, which prompted the British soldiers to respond with the first Noel. Finally, all the soldiers came together in a rendition of O Come All Ye Faithful. Number 3, Many soldiers left the trenches and ventured into no man's land. This provided an opportunity for enemies to come face to face and wish one another a Merry Christmas. Gifts were exchanged and photographs were taken in the temporary period of peace. Number 4, The generals of the armies did not respond well to Christmas truce which meant that it was the first and last time it happened during the war. It also became one of the last small truces of World War I. Number 5, There is a lot of doubt surrounding the idea that the soldiers took part in a football match. Some sources report that the Germans won the match 3-2 after a British soldier started it, but historians say there is no concrete evidence that anything football related ever happened. Number 6, there were more instruments than just the voices of soldiers, since reports were made of brass bands from the Germans' trenches. Number 7, some of the soldiers were ordered to start fighting again at midnight of December 26, while others continued the truce until New Year's Day. Number 8, French Village there is a plaque dedicated solely to the Christmas truce of 1914. It was first revealed on 11th of November 2008. Number 9, even though the soldiers became friendly with each other for the day, they were not allowed to go to the trenches of the opposite side. Doing so would have meant discovering private information, such as the number of guns or supplies they had. Number 10, when the Germans first came outside of their trenches shouting Merry Christmas in English, the British soldiers thought they were being lured into a trap. However, when they realized that the soldiers were unarmed, they stepped forward and began wishing their enemies Merry Christmas in German. <laughs>